This is Rockport Ryan with Texas Fishing Tips, and this is your weekly fishing report. All right, Texas Fishing Tips, this is Rockport Ryan. Hope y'all had a, a great holiday this past week. Uh, some of those launches were pretty busy, so we took the opportunity to go to some other places that weren't as crowded. Coming out here in Aransas Pass, but we're by the Aquatic Center. When you launch and come out, don't just cut to the left and go straight out to the water. As you approach that island in front of you, over in that cove, we've actually managed to pick up some nice reds right there, straight off the launch. Come around to the right, around that island. When you come to that first opening, there were some reds that were hanging out into there. When we came all the way out, uh, we have had some lower water and everything. So where we spent most of our time was on the outside of these islands, uh, casting back into some of those deeper cuts. Coming out and around, we went around the back side of this island and with that south wind, just kind of paddled out and drifted back towards the island out here in this opening, picked up some nice reds on top water. Another place we were able to hide from the crowds was coming out here in Goose Island. Both sides of this channel where the boat ramp launches were producing some nice fish, especially on the outside of the canal entrance into that housing project all up in there was producing some nice reds all that was on top water as we came out working along the cuts between these bartel islands and then out in some of this deeper water went to popping cork and gulp and managed to get some trout coming into east pocket we decided to start on this far side between the island and the mainland of bird point produced some reds and inside both of these coves with that south wind it was producing some nice bait activity and we were able to get into some reds as we tried to come across the lower water levels it just wound up getting too shallow so definitely stay on the, the northern side of these areas uh and again it was top waters for the reds for corpus uh launching down here by wind and wave uh coming all in this area uh there's some nice grass beds on the edges of the grass beds where the reds were hanging out on the front of this little wellhead, we had some nice reds out and around the uh, little rigs that are out here. There were some nice sheep's head pulling up right about here. You're, it's shallow enough that you can park the kayak and cast back into these deeper areas. Those are producing some nice reds and then coming over to this cut that goes underneath the causeway. Up in there, we're also producing some nice reds. Didn't see a whole lot of trout, but mostly what we saw were red drum, black drum, and some sheep's head. You come out here, and then the nice thing is, is you just let the wind drift you all the way back, fan casting. In this area is where we started to hit into a few schools of trout. And again, everything was hitting on top water that day. This is Rockport Ryan. Thank you for watching.